As you know, we all gather together here to celebrate one of the most important day, so-called World Environment Day. It might be a single day in a calendar, but it must be our priority for everyday life because we're doing something wrong day by day by declining our environmental condition. Air pollution, climate change, sea level rise, soil pollution, all those just happen because of our ignorance. Because, because we didn't pay enough attention to what we're doing. We should accept we did some mistakes and we're all here to take positive acts, try to neutralize the negative effects of those uh, mistakes. So we're all here to cultivate environmental awareness into the people's minds, public, students. We're here to announce that we did something wrong. We're here to try to compensate. We're here to say that we make skies and oceans as two global garbage cans. Air pollution does not need visa to travel across the borders. We are here to be a part of the solution, not a pollution. So let's clean air for all, all for clean air. So do you think today's event will change people's minds about air pollution? As Dr. Jane Goodall's remind us every time, every individual matters. Every individual has a role to play. And this is our role. Yes, I do believe 100 percent that we can change people's minds. This looks like single steps, simple ones, can make a very big difference. One word for people around the world. The good thing about the World Environment Day is this is not just a local actions. This is a global event. So every other people Right now, more than a thousand different companies, students, universities, they've involved. So all of us are going to share our news with the world. And we will show to the world that we are not alone. Actually, ni ngumu sana kupangilia mipango kwa haraka kiasi hicho lakini tunajitahidi kuelimisha jamii na watu wote hapa Taiwan katika nchi nzuri kabisa kuhakikisha kwamba air pollution au uh, air pollution inakuwa ndogo kidogo tunapunguza uh, kwa sababu kuna maafa na mangamizi kadha wa kadha hapa Taiwan yanaweza kutokea World Health Organization has defined air pollution as the presence in air of substance put there by acts of man in concentration sufficient to interfere with the comfort, safety, or health of man or with the full use or enjoyment of his property. We know that the air pollution in Taiwan is really high. So if we don't take initiatives now, it might be too late for us to do anything or even breathe some fresh air in future. So our small in initiative can make a huge difference, we believe. Because together we can and we are doing it as a whole. As the entire university is taking part in this today. Honestly, this situation we can't say it's only for for certain countries, maybe one or two countries, maybe Taiwan and China because they are highly polluted. No, it shouldn't be like that. It should be for every country, every nation. We have to work hard continuously to get natural, fresh environment to its real, physical and mental comfort. We have to get control over this demand and save life by planting more trees. Well managing waste from industries and factories, reducing need of heavy vehicles, changing our daily life, Style and other effective steps. We students from Changjiang Christian University of Taiwan pledge to. Improve public awareness about air pollution. Improve public awareness about air pollution.